This is Michael Wilson. We're looking at the question, are we in a funk? Well, sometimes it is just that. We're in a funk. And we all know how that feels. We cannot see clearly. We wander around under a cloud. Nothing is right. We've given up. We've turned in the keys to the house. But we have good news. We have good news, brothers and sisters. We don't have to live under the black cloud. No need to be in a funk. Jesus has arrived. He is the Messiah. And he's always here for us. So we read in Romans 8, 1. This is stunning. There is therefore now no condemnation for those who are in the Messiah, Jesus. Now, the word condemnation here is interesting. It means a guilty verdict, a sentence of punishment in our state of being where we're condemned, that's a funk. In the context of Roman 8, 1, it refers to the condemnation that we deserve as sinners for holy God. When we feel like we have to be punished, we're in a funk. So the Bible says that we have all sinned and fallen short of the glory of God, and the wages of sin is death. Now that's depressing. It's a funk. Without Jesus, we are under God's wrath and judgment. We have no hope of escaping it. But the good news, the stunning news, is that God has provided us a way to be saved from that condemnation through his son, Jesus. Jesus came to this world as the Messiah, the anointed one, the one who fulfilled the law, and he fulfilled the prophets, and he lived a sinless life and died on the cross for our sins and rose again from the dead. He is the only one who can save us from our sins and reconcile us to God. And the good news is he has done it. No need to be in a funk. The Bible says, you just confess your sins with your mouth that Jesus and acknowledge that Jesus is his master and believe in your heart that God raised him from the dead, you will be saved. So when we put our faith in Jesus as our master and savior, we are no longer in a funk. We're not condemned by God. We are forgiven, justified, adopted, sanctified, and glorified. We are in the Messiah, and the Messiah is in us, and we have a new identity and a new relationship and a new destiny. Now, that's some extremely good news, brothers and sisters.